bending skill set. You know, we've got two skill sets on the harmonica that are big studies for, for students. Tongue right. rocking, bending. Uh, bending gives us our bluesy notes, our blue notes. You know? Right, right. And uh, did you specifically do anything to uh, to work on dialing your bending skills, or did you just keep on playing the songs till you could match the pitches? Keep on playing the songs till I could match the pitches and practice. You know, you got this thing in your pocket, and you're going. What is that? I can't remember that. But those little. I'm playing light too. I know for. Sit around in the wherever, but yeah. you know that to me is real stiff. Mm -hmm. When you start adding, a, you know, <laughs> then the dynamics come in, uh -huh. and that's what I then. You're getting it, and then I just go over and over, and I screwed up there. But I, you know, to me, it's just like you'll get it right, you'll get it right. <laughs> right, mm -hmm. with a little more. Yeah. That's really, to me, when a harmonica player is, you know, has the the. The dynamic range of it. That's mm -hmm. somebody who can really play. As a, to me, as like I hear harmonica players that can play and know all the stuff, but it's like having a monotone conversation with somebody who's really high on on meth, and they're just going like this, and you know, and all this stuff that what they're doing, they're playing their things, and there's everything, and there's no tone variation. Yeah. And it makes the harmonica. And if you hear the harmonica over and over and over again, I, I don't want to hear it anymore. Mm -hmm. You know. And that's what's so cool about little Walter. I mean, there's this bright smile, this soulful, and the honks, but this, this, everything's this different tone variation. Mm -hmm. You know, you know, and then he's like, you know, he's like flowing. You know, he's he's singing. He's playing the instrument. So dynamics, yeah. dynamics, Louds, yeah. Soft, Loud tone and soft. changes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and Juke's a great example. You know, you right. a lot of a lot of the. We're on a beef on harmonica, by the way. And before I get too far uh, off 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 topic for a moment, um, you're doing that three drop. Right. And then mm -hmm. uh, working the three draw bend, three draw, three half, three whole, and pretty much what you're saying is to take a famous song, something that you're familiar with, right. and keep working, find songs that use bends and stuff right, like right. that, so you've got that oral, oral reference. Right. Um, but dynamics, completely agree. This is one of those, it's one of those uh, tips you can give somebody where you're not actually teaching them something new in their mouth, you're not teaching them a new lick or a new song, right. but how to take what they know how to play and make it greater by implementing what you're talking about, the balance and the softs. So yes. That's important stuff. It is important stuff. And I mean, to me, that's soul. That's when you're playing the instrument with soul. And um, um, that's it, man. I hear, mm -hmm. Like I said, I hear a lot of hard players that, man, they're absolutely incredible. But it's just like, one, slow down. Two, um, you know, you slow down. Space <laughs> is important. Mm -hmm. And, um, and, Play dynamically, how you feel, <coughs> because they're not going to play the same thing. You know, you could sit there and play a chromatic piece and have, you know, as if it's written now, and be beautiful. That guy, I love that guy. That uh, I just discovered him, and I saw that you have an interview with him. What's his name? The, uh, the country harmonica player, and um, Christian guy. What's his name? Uh, uh, um, um, uh, see that? <laughs> It'll come to me in a moment. 
Buddy Green. Buddy Green. Yeah. What, what a, it looks like a really nice guy. No doubt. And you know, and he's, you know, he's, he's, how does he remember all that? You know, he has that stuff down to a T. Plus he has all the, uh, you know, he plays soulfully. Mm -hmm. But you can tell, he's like worked at it. I do the same thing, you know. Um, you're hearing a lot of riffs from me and stuff, but I just, they are riffs as if to something, you know, there's single note riffs, there is the swinging riffs of little Walter with various, all these different kind of uh, textures and approaches and techniques and stuff like that to give the desired effect that you want. A tongue flutter, you know. <laughs> You know, or you know, so, so, yeah. yeah.